so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Are you excited to draw with me? Yeah, I am too. And today, you and I are gonna draw a fruit. Yeah, not a vegetable, a fruit. Hey, and will you guess what fruit it is? I'll describe it to you. It's a big fruit. It's circular. Yeah, nice and round. It's very heavy. It's green on the outside, but when you cut it open on the inside, what you eat is the color red. Mm, yum, yeah, it's a watermelon. Not just any watermelon, it's a cocoa melon watermelon. Are you excited? Yeah, let's draw. Okay, first I'm gonna take the color green and draw a big circle. Woohoo! There we go, just like that. Whoa, perfect! And then on the inside, we're gonna draw a square with rounded edges. Yeah, and that's a TV. There we go. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, yeah, and now let's draw some watermelon lines. Whoa, yeah, there we go, perfect. Whoa, yeah, wow, now it's looking like a watermelon, right? Okay, I'm gonna take the color black though next, and then I'm gonna draw the top. Yeah, the antennas, draw a half circle just like that, and then whoop, 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 yeah, there we go, whoa. Small little circles, just like that. And then, what about for the face right here? Yeah, two big eyes. One circle right there. There we go. Oh, fill it in with the color black. So then this watermelon can see. <laughs> and there's another one right there. <laughs> okay, what are we missing right here? Right here. Yeah? Okay, the nose. Boop. And then a big smile. Whoa! Yeah, that definitely looks like the Coco Melon Watermelon. Wow! Did you have fun drawing with me? Yeah, I had fun drawing with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? B L I P P I. Flippy! Alright, see you again! Bye bye! So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout Flippy! Hey, 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 hey! It's me, Flippy! And do you like to draw? I do too! And today, you and I are gonna draw a sheep! Okay, I'm gonna take this black marker and draw an oval, just like that. And then I'm gonna draw two circles for the eyes. And did you know sheep, yeah, their pupils, they're actually rectangles. So then I'm gonna draw two rectangles, just like that. And then I'll draw an arched line and two little dots. All right, now for the body. Yeah, the big fluffy body. Whoa, look at that. Doesn't it look soft? I know. All right, and then draw four legs, just like that. Whoa, and now two droopy ears, Wee! and then one on this side. Whoa, isn't that cute? Yeah, 
And let's add some more softness to the top of its head. Wow, so soft. Yeah, sheep are so cool. They actually have a very good sense of smell, and they even use it to communicate with each other sometimes. Whoa, wasn't this fun drawing the sheep together? I know. Well, if you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Make learning fun, blippy, blippy, blippy. So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout, blippy. So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout, blippy. Hey, it's me, Blippy. Did you see what I'm holding? Yeah, a guitar, a really small guitar. I know it's a guitar because it has six strings. Looks like a ukulele, but it's a guitar. <laughs> All right, let's set that down right there because you and I are gonna draw a guitar together today. Okay, let's start with the color blue. Well, actually, let's be creative. That guitar is blue, so let's use green. <laughs> you can use any color you want. So I'm gonna draw the body of the guitar. Let's go like this. Whoa, yeah, whoa, whoa. What a cool shape, wow. And hard rocker guitars can have crazy shapes. They can even look like stars. But this one is gonna be an acoustic guitar because I'm gonna draw a circle right there. Yeah, and then, yeah, the, the reverberation from the strings goes in here, and reverberates, and that's what you hear. Okay, and now let's draw a long rectangle right there. That's the bridge. Whoa, and right here is the neck. Whoa, it's so long. And then up here, whoop, let's draw an oval, just like that, and six pegs. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, those tighten and loosen, and that is what you tune the guitar with. And then what's it missing? What do you strum? Yeah, strings. We need six strings because it's a guitar. So first, let's go right here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Whoa, what a great guitar. Whoa, shall I try playing the guitar again? Yeah, cue that music. Yeah, that was so much fun learning to draw with you and playing this radical guitar. Whoa, if you wanna keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Here we go. B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye bye. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout. Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout. Blippi. Hey, it's me, Blippi. And do you like to draw? Yeah, I do too. And I have a fun thing for us to draw. Today, let's draw a duck. Not just any duck. Let's draw Declan the duck. Wow, what a cool duck. Ducks I really like because they quack. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> yeah, and their feet, yeah, they have webbed feet so they can swim super fast. Okay, I'm gonna start with the color orange so then I can draw his beak. All right, here we go. Let's draw a line right here. Whoa, 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 just like that. And then let's draw, yeah, an arch line like that. And that is his beak, <laughs> yeah. His beak is the color orange. Ooh, and then for his head, whoa, nice big head. Ooh, and a nice little cheek right there. There we go. And let's draw his eyes, half circle, and a half circle within the half circle. And then his pupils, there we go. Let's color him in, just like that. Whoa, cute duck. All right, let's draw his neck. Then his body, wow, his body is so big. Yeah, it looks like he's floating on the water already, right? And then let's draw a cute little tail. Yeah, the tail is a feather. 
feather. One big feather. Oh, and then his wing right here. Oh, and then let's take orange again and draw his legs. Okay, one leg right here, one leg right there, and then for his feet. One, two, three lines, just like that. There we go. Whoa, what cute feet. Oh, did you know ducks don't float on top of the water by paddling their feet? Yeah, it's actually trapping air bubbles within their wings and it keeps them nice and buoyant. Whoa, I love ducks. Hey, and I really enjoy drawing this duck with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Quack, 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 quack. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippy, Blippy. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippy. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippy. Hey, 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 it's me, Blippy. And today, you and I are going to draw Twinkle from Little Baby Bum. Wow, Twinkle is such a cute star in the night sky. Yeah, and she's always smiling. Okay, to draw Twinkle, you need either yellow or orange. And we're going to draw a lot of curved lines that come to a point. All right, just like that. Whoa, very thick looking star, right? Whoa, there we go. And one last one. Whoa, yeah. All right, now we need to draw some circles for the eyes. Whoa, a big circle, another big circle, and then fill in a small circle. Yeah, just like that. And then short, small little lines for the cute, pretty eyelashes. Then a big smile. But we also need to draw a pink bow tie. There we go, just like that. Whoa, there we go. Yeah, she's so cute. <laughs> well, if you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi. Are you ready to draw with me? Yeah, it's going to be so much fun, because today we're going to draw Matt the Bat. Wow, what a great bat. And it was so cool how Matt taught me how bats see in the dark. Yeah, with echolocation. Whoa. So I'm going to take the color black and draw Matt's goggles. He actually wears these goggles on top of his head, just like that. Four circles, two inside, and then they connect, just like that. And then we'll draw his head. Whoa! And now for his eyes. Whoa! Big circle right there, another circle right there. And then we'll go like this. Whoa, one eye, two eyes. Oh, there he is. Whoa! And then what do bats have on top of their head? Whoa, really big ears. Whoa, really cool. They kind of look like leaves, huh? But they're actually the bat's ears. And then we'll do a nose right there. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> and then a big smile, because Matt is nice and happy. Boop. <laughs> nice tongue. All right, now for Matt's body. Whoa. And actually, Matt wears a scarf. Let's go like this. Woo, yeah. And it's flying, whoa, probably because he's flying. Bats love to fly. All right, let's go like this and draw a very big wing. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> and then a wing over here. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> and then his two legs, just like that. Ooh, ooh, straight lines. Whoa, and check this out. Yeah, the bones and the wings. Whoa, whoa, super cool. Whoa, and you want to see something even more cool? Whoa, some bats like to live in caves, and they like to hang upside down. Whoa, look, just hanging from the cave. Whoa, that was so much fun drawing Matt the Bat with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. 
Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? <laughs> B L I P P I. Blippy. All right. See you again. Bye bye. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippy. It's me, Blippi. Are you ready to have some fun and draw something together? Yeah! Today, why don't you and I draw an insect? Will you guess which insect? First, it starts out as a caterpillar, and then it undergoes metamorphosis and transforms into this insect. It has beautiful, colorful wings. Yeah! It's a butterfly! Wow! I love butterflies! Oh, why don't we start with the color black and draw its head? Okay, a small circle right up there. Oh, and let's make a smiley face. There we go, a nice happy butterfly. And then let's draw its body way down here. Whoa! Yeah! Very tall. <laughs> wow. All right, now let's draw its wings. Whoa! One big wing right up there. Whoa, and the same thing on this other side. Whoa, and then let's add some color. Whoa, how about this bottom wing can be red. Oh, there we go. There we go. Whoa, what a beautiful butterfly so far, right? Wow, and do you see how I'm making everything the same on both sides? That's called symmetrical. Yeah, so if I make a circle right here, I will make a circle on this side. If I make a line like that, I'll then make a line like this. Whoa! And we can keep adding some color. How about some purple? Whoa! Oh, butterflies are so beautiful. There we go. They just flap around. And if you've ever seen a butterfly just hanging out, yeah, maybe soaking up some sun. Yeah, they're actually trying to warm up their body. They need the heat to fly. Whoa! How about some green? Whoa, there we go. Whoa, what a cool looking butterfly. There we go, and then let's add some blue. Are you ready? Let's do a small circle right there, small right there, Whoop. and some curved lines at the bottom. Wow, what about the top? Do you know what they have on top of their heads? Yeah, antennas. All right, let's go like this, curved line with a small little circle, curved line with a small little circle. Wow, butterflies are awesome. And you are awesome. That was so much fun learning to draw with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout Blippi. Me, Blippi. Have you ever played on a playground outside at the park? Wow, isn't it so much fun? I love swinging on the swings. Hey, why don't you and I, we draw a swing together. All right, I'm gonna start with the color black and I'm gonna make, yeah, it looks like the smile on a smiley face. Oh, but I'm actually making the seat just like that. And I'm gonna do two of them. Whoa, yeah, it also kind of looks like a banana, huh? <laughs> All right, then let's do four vertical lines, just like that. All right, now let's draw the start of a square. Don't connect the bottom. And then let's draw two diagonal lines, and there it is, there's a swing. But hey, what's at a park most of the time? Yeah, a lot of grass. Whoa, <laughs> what a beautiful swing set. <laughs> well, if you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. -P -P -I. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Come on, everyone, let's make learning fun. It'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi! Do you know what machine I was acting like? Yeah, an excavator! And today, you and I are gonna draw an excavator! 
All right, let's take the black and the orange marker and let's draw some shapes. First, let's draw a very long rectangle. Whoa, just like that. And then let's draw a square on top of that one and a square inside the square for the window. That's where the operator sits. All right, and then a very long rectangle like this. Yeah, and a circle right here, another rectangle right there. Yeah, and now we need to draw the bucket. Some teeth. Whoa, cool. Now we have the arm, the boom, and the bucket. And now we need to draw a very long oval with some small circles on the inside, just like that. Whoa, that was so much fun. And I love excavators. And if you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -I, Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone, let's make learning fun. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Flippy! So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Flippy! Hey, it's me, Flippy. I sure do love drawing with you. It's so much fun. What? There's a giant pencil somewhere? Whoa, you're right. There is a pencil. Wow. Hey, why don't you and I draw a pencil together? Okay, first, I'm going to take a black marker and draw a triangle. Whoa, that's the part of the pencil that you color and draw with. Ooh, and let's draw a squiggly line like that and then two really long straight lines. And since the pencil isn't smooth, I'm going to draw lines like that so then it has some texture. And then let's draw some ovals like that. And then, yeah, the eraser. That's the part that you erase with. Wow, isn't that pencil really good looking? Yeah, I love drawing with you. If you like drawing with me and you want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. Hey, it's me, Blippi. Whoa, I'm climbing up a ladder. I'm acting like a firefighter to save someone. I'll come help you! <laughs> hey, why don't you and I draw a ladder? Ladders are so useful. Yeah, for firefighters. So then they can get up to the top of the building and help people. Or maybe you're a painter and you need to get up really high to paint the ceiling. Whoa! All right, to draw a ladder, let's draw a diagonal line just like that. Whoa! And then another diagonal line just like that. And watch this do two more lines right next to them. And then if you make an arch up here, an arch right there, one at the bottom, one at the bottom, now they're really long ovals. And then if we draw some horizontal lines, just like this, that is what you use to step on. Yeah, those are the steps. <laughs> I sure do love drawing. And if you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. Hey, it's me, Blippi. And do you like to draw? Yeah, I do too. Why don't we draw an animal? Have you seen an animal around here lately? A snake? Right here? Whoa, you're right. Hey, snake. Wow, I love snakes. Yeah, they're reptiles. They just slither around. Whoa, I'm going to take the color green and draw a snake. So what I'm going to do is do a squiggly line. All right, start over here. Whoa, whoa. And then I'll make a point right here for the tail. Whee! And then just follow that squiggly line back. There we go. 
Yeah, and then I'll make a nice little head like that. And then we'll do an eye and a smile. And then what do they have right here? Yeah, a tongue. Let's go like this. Yeah, and did you know snakes actually smell with their tongue? Whoa, really cool. Now let's just draw some lines. Yeah, make it nice and cute. Whoa, that was so much fun. If you love drawing and want to draw more with me, yeah, like cool things like this, like the snake, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -I, Blippi. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Happy birthday, yeah! Hey, it's me, Blippi. And since it's someone's birthday out there, why don't we draw a birthday cake together? Oh, I love birthday parties. They're so much fun. Yeah, because a big group of people get together around the cake, they sing happy birthday, and then whoever's birthday it is, they blow out the candles. <laughs> oh, and then you get to eat the cake. So yummy. So let's draw a straight line. And then the first layer of the cake. There we go. And then let's draw the second layer of the cake. Oh, this is going to be a big, tasty cake. Ooh, and let's draw three small rectangles. Yeah, these are the candles because this person is turning three years old. Ooh, and can't forget about the little flames up top. There we go. So then they can blow them out, but we're not done yet. We need some icing, yum! Wow. Well, if you wanna keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. See you later, bye-bye. Come on everyone, let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi, so much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout, Blippi. Hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, you and I are gonna draw a dinosaur. A dinosaur with plates on its back and spikes on its tail. Yeah, you guessed it, a stegosaurus. All right, to draw a stegosaurus, let's draw a curved line for its back. Ooh, and then a curved line for its tail, just like that. And then let's go down and draw four legs because stegosauruses have four legs. <laughs> and then a straight line for the body, two more legs to complete the four, and then, yeah, some curved lines for the head. Whoa, can't forget about the circle for the eye and little smiley face. Yeah, but what's it missing? Yeah, the plates. And every stegosaurus had 17 or more plates. So will you count 17 with me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Cool. All right. That was so much fun drawing the stegosaurus with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi. See you later, red stegosaurus. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's make the It'll make you want to shout, Blippi!
so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, you and I are going to draw a bee. Bzz. Not just any bee, bee from Lullaby City Farm. Whoa, bees are very important for our environment and pollination. All right, to draw a bee, I'm going to take blue and draw a circle for the head. Ooh, an arched line for the body. Ooh, and some more curved lines for the wings. There we go. And can't forget about the cute legs. Ooh, and two arms. There we go. <laughs> wow. All right, let's draw some circles for the eyes like that. Whoa, there we go. <laughs> it's starting to look like B, right? And then some suspenders. There we go. Yeah, for the overalls. Cool. And B actually has stripes, just like a regular B. There we go. <laughs> and then let's draw a big smile, just like that. And you can't forget about the antennas. There we go. <laughs> all right. If you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. All right. See you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make money. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi. Shall we draw a spooky spider web? Yeah! I'm going to take the color black and draw a plus right in the middle. Yeah, an addition symbol? Yeah, just like that. And then let's draw an X through that. There we go. Whoa! Have you ever felt a spider web? They're so sticky, but did you know they're actually very strong? Whoa! And then let's do a bunch of V's like this, and this is how it attaches to the doorway, or the hallway, or the bathroom door, or the floor, or the ceiling. I don't know, they could be anywhere and everywhere. Yeah, there's a lot of spiders around here. Okay, let's arch like this. That's definitely looking like a spider web, right? Okay, just a few more. Wow, that definitely looks like a spider web. And watch this, I'll even draw a spider. There we go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight legs. Wow, that was so much fun drawing. If you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Are you ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Blippi. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Come on, everyone, let's make learning fun. It'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! Hey, 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 it's me, Blippi. Today, you and I are gonna draw a ladybug. Not just any ladybug, the Coco Melon Ladybug. All right, first, we need to grab a black marker. Okay, let's draw a circle right here for the head. Ooh, and a big circle for oval for the body. And then we have some legs right here. Oh, yeah! Starting to look like a ladybug, right? What does the ladybug have on its back? Yeah, black circles. There we go. Oh, ladybugs are so cute. I love how they fly. Yeah, they're just so free. And then we have a couple antennas. Yeah, just like that. And then an eye. Yeah. Whoa! There she is. Okay. And what else do we need? Yeah, the color red. Here we go. Yeah. Whoa, I love coloring. Whoa, so cute. Well, if you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. See you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi. Hey, it's me, Blippi. Have you ever been to a playground before? 
I know, they're so much fun. They have slides that you can slide down. They have swings that you can swing on. Ooh, and they even have seesaws. Whoa, have you ever ridden a seesaw before? They're so much fun. I love riding seesaws, especially with my best friend Mika. Wait a second, why don't we draw a seesaw together? All right, first I'm gonna draw a very tall half of a oval, just like that. Whoa, and then we'll draw a circle right up top. And that is where you balance at. And then someone's gonna be way up top, right up here. And that's gonna be a very long rectangle. And then someone will be at the very bottom down here. And that board is gonna be nice and strong. And what do you hold on to? Yeah, handles. So let's draw the letter T, just like that. Whoa, way up high, so scary, but so fun. All right, hold on tight so you're nice and safe. Whoa, if you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Blippi. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Come on everyone, let's make learning fun. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi! And do you want to draw something with me? Yeah! What a great piece of paper for that! Hey, why don't we draw an animal together? But what animal? Oh, you saw a stuffed animal earlier? Where? Oh, right here? Whoa, yeah! A stuffed animal! And this is a dolphin! Whoa, dolphins love to swim in the water. Whoa, especially the ocean. Wow, cool, that's a great idea. So let's take the color blue and start with the top of the body. So we're gonna draw a very long arch and make a gap right in the middle, just like that, for the fin. Look at that, whoa, cool. And then let's draw the tail. Whoop, whoo, whoop, whoo. And then, Let's draw the bottom of the body. There we go. And you can't forget about, yeah, just like that. And a big smile and an eye. Now it's looking like a dolphin, right? Is it complete? No, it needs fins. Let's draw one right there on that side. And then we go like this. Oh, there's one. Perfect. Yeah, one, two, three fins. Yeah, and the tail. Yeah, those aren't fins, but that's one tail. Whoa, and do you see how it looks like it's smiling? Yeah, dolphins always look like they're smiling, even if they're not smiling. Whoa, dolphins are so cool. They live in groups. Yeah, about 10 to 12 dolphins, and that is called a pod, a pod of dolphins. Yeah, and dolphins actually don't breathe underwater. They hold their breath, just like you and I. And do you know how they breathe? Yeah, they have a little hole right there. There we go, yeah, that's the blowhole. When they go to the surface, they get some air, and then when they go underwater, they hold their breath. Whoa, dolphins are so cool. And they're also very smart. Their brains are as big as yours and mine. Wow, very smart, very cool animals. Well, if you like drawing a dolphin with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Flippy. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Flippy, come on everyone, let's make learning fun. Flippy, Flippy, so much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Flippy, so much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Flippy. Me, Blippi. Are you ready to draw some shapes together? Yeah, it's gonna be so much fun. Okay, I'm gonna take the color orange. Let's draw a triangle, rectangle, and diamond today. First, let's draw a triangle. One side, two sides, three sides. Whoa, triangles have three sides. Can you think of anything that looks like this triangle? Yeah, the roof to a house. Whoa, pretty cool house, huh? Whoa, there we go. All right, what about a rectangle? Whoa, one, two, three, 
four sides. Wow, that's a big rectangle. Can you think of anything that looks like a rectangle? Yeah, like a brick. Whoa, there we go. Yeah, so then you can build that house. Whoa, what about a diamond? One, two, three, four. Four sides as well. Whoa, hey, and check it out. If you drew a line right here, it looks like two triangles. Yeah, on top of each other, mirroring each other. Can you think of anything that looks like this? Yeah, a kite. Wow, this has been so much fun drawing shapes with you. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Come on, everyone, let's make learning fun. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Flippy! So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Flippy! I'll be right there. I'm almost there. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, it's me, Flippy. I was running a bit late. Oh, that's a great idea. Why don't we draw a clock together? Okay, let me take the color black. Yeah, and draw a big circle. There we go. All right, and then let's draw a small circle right in the middle. Whoa, it kind of looks like an eyeball, but we're drawing a clock. All right, to draw a clock, we need to write the numbers one through 12 around the whole thing. So here we go. Let's one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. There we go. And there's two hands. Yeah, the shorter hand is to tell what hour it is. And the longer hand is to tell what minute it is. Let's draw the shorter hand pointing to the number 12. Let's draw a long one pointing to the number three. It's 12, 15. Whoa, great. Well, I sure do love drawing with you. And if you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. All right, see you again. <laughs> Make learning fun. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Flippy! So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Flippy! Hey, it's me, Flippy. And do you like to draw? I do too. I have a great idea. Why don't we draw something together? Yeah! Well, what should we draw? Oh, a mermaid. That sounds pretty fun. I love mermaids. I've never seen one in real life, but they're pretty cool. Yeah, it's half human, half fish. What else could you ask for? <laughs> Not a whole lot. <laughs> All right, let's draw the body, which is, yeah, half fish. All right, let's go like that and do an arc line like that. Whoa, yeah. And then for the tail, there we go. Whoa, I bet this mermaid can swim super fast. Okay, now let's draw the human part. Yeah, here we go. Let's just do a little thing like that. So then we show a little section between the fish and the human. And then we need the shoulders of the mermaid. Oh, let's go in just a little bit more for the neck. And then a big circle for the head. Oh, and then two small circles for the eyes. A big smiley face. Yeah, because she's so happy to be a mermaid. Oh, and then let's go like this for the hair. Whoa, whoa, yeah, there we go. Oh, what a beautiful mermaid. And then let's draw some fins for the arms. There we go. Whoa, what a beautiful mermaid. She's just hanging out in the water, swimming around, enjoying life. <laughs> well, if you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> Will you spell my name with me? Yeah. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Flippy. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. 
So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout, Blippi! Hey, 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 it's me, Blippi. Are you ready to draw something with me? Yeah, today you and I are gonna draw an alligator. I know this is an alligator and not a crocodile stuffed animal because of its snout. Do you see how rounded it is? Yeah, alligators have rounded snouts. If this is a crocodile, it would come up to a point and back down. So today, you and I are gonna draw an alligator. Okay, here you go, buddy. You can stay right there. Okay, I'm gonna take the color green and start with its snout. So remember, Let's draw a sideways U. Yeah, nice and soft edges. There we go. Now let's go back right here. Whoa, for the bottom of the mouth. Whoa, perfect. And now for a spot for the eye on top of its head right there. And now I'm gonna go all the way back. But do you see how I'm not drawing a straight line? I'm kind of doing it jagged. Ooh, there you go. Yeah, because its body yeah, has scales and skin. There we go. Yeah, and that is its tail. Check this out. Whoa, now we need to loop all the way around. Whoa, there we go. Whoa, perfect, it's looking pretty good. But what's on its body right here? Yeah, legs, whoa, cute legs. There we go, whoa. And then two back here, whoop, whoop, yeah. And now for the eye, let's draw a circle and color it in, okay? Just like that, whoa. What is this alligator missing? in its mouth. Ah, yeah, sharp teeth, whoa. I always am very careful and stay a safe distance whenever I see an alligator. Yeah, they're, they're pretty dangerous, but they're also really cool creatures to look at from afar. Okay, let's draw some teeth right here. Whoa, so cool, there we go. Whoa, what sharp teeth it has. Oh, and let's get a nostril right up front, right there, so then it can smell. Whoa, that was so much fun drawing an alligator with you. And remember how to tell the difference between an alligator and a crocodile. An alligator has a nice rounded snout, but a crocodile has a nice pointed snout. Whoa, that was so much fun drawing with you. If you wanna draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Blippi. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Come on everyone, let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout. Blippi, so much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout. Blippi. It's me, Blippi. Are you ready to draw a cat with me? Yeah, I love cats. They're so cool. And their balance is amazing. Okay, I'm gonna start with the color brown. Draw a big circle for the head. Whoa, and now let's draw a couple triangles for the ears. Whoa, there we go. And now some triangles inside those triangles, just like that. And let's do two small circles for the eyes. Whoa, there we go. And what about this? The nose, an upside down triangle. And there's the mouth. Let's draw some whiskers, ready? One, two, three, four! One, two, three, four! There we go. And now, let's draw the body. Yeah, let's go big oval, just like that. And then one, two, three, four. Four legs. Ooh, and what's it missing? Yeah, the tail. Here we go. Whoa, yeah! Wow, I sure do like cats. What cool animals. Well, if you like drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Meow, meow. Blippi, come on everyone, let's make learning fun. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi. Are you ready to draw a witch's hat? Whoa, witch's hats are so cool and spooky. All right, I'm gonna start with the color black. And what I'm gonna do is draw an upside down ice cream cone. Do you like ice cream? Okay, let's make a point right up here. 
Whoa, and then go down here. Whoa, they're so pointy. And then let's connect these, but let's do a little arch right there. Whoa, and now let's draw an oval. But what we're gonna do is not connect it in the middle. Yeah, let's go like this. Whee, whoa, very big. Yeah, that definitely looks like a witch's hat. Okay, and now right here, let's draw this. Yeah, a rectangle, a rectangle. Ooh, and let's connect them like this. And then two lines. Ooh, there we go. Yeah, do you know what that is? That's a buckle. Yeah, it's a design. Interesting. Wow, that was so much fun drawing a witch's hat with you. If you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. -P -P -I. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. <laughs> Me, Blippi! Do you want to draw a sea turtle with me? Yeah! I love sea turtles. They are so cute. I love how they have a shell and then they can swim underwater. Whoa! All right, first I'm going to take this green marker and draw the shell. So I'm going to draw a big curved line like that. And then another curved line right there. Woo! And then that looks like the shell, doesn't it? Yeah, shells are really hard. Up here, I'm going to draw the neck and the head. Whoa, perfect. And I'm gonna color in a circle for the eye and then a smiley face. Yeah. All right, let's draw another curved line like this. Ooh, and another curved line like that. And three more curved lines right up there to complete the shell. And then we need to draw four squares for the legs. Well, actually they're not legs. They're actually fins on sea turtles. Yeah. So then they can swim underwater. Wow, I love sea turtles and I love drawing. If you want to draw with me some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Have you ever wanted to be an astronaut and go into outer space? Yeah, me too. Maybe you and I should draw a rocket ship together. Oh, let's use the color purple. Yeah, rocket ships are how astronauts get into outer space. So let's draw a point right up top. Looks like the start of a triangle, right? And then these two lines go straight down. And if you connected right there and right there, which we won't, that would be a rectangle. Instead, we're gonna draw a circle for the porthole. All right, let's draw a really small rectangle down here. There we go. And then we need some fins. Yeah, a couple straight lines just like that. Whoa, this rocket looks fast, doesn't it? And then a straight line right there to make another rectangle. Ooh, some dots. Yeah, for some bolts so it stays all connected. And then some flames. Whoa! Wasn't that so much fun? Whoa! If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. All right. See you again. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Whoa! Hey! It's me, Blippi! Are you ready to draw with me today? Yeah! Today, you and I are gonna draw the T-Rex 1 UTV from T-Rex Ranch. Wow, what a cool looking vehicle, right? Whoa! It's so cool because it goes so fast! Okay, I'm gonna start with the color black right here. Whoa, because I'm gonna draw the wheels, or actually the tires first. 
Okay, let's draw one tire right here. Whoa! And then one tire right there. Look at those two big circles. And then I'll take the color green. Whoa! And draw a circle on the inside, just like that. And one right there. And now for the body. Yeah! Let's go like this for the tailgate. There we go. Woo! There we go. Whoa! This UTV is very fast. Whoa, yeah, the park rangers at T-Rex Ranch, they use the T-Rex one to get around. Yeah, they go visit tons of different dinosaurs there. Okay, now let's get back to black, and then let's draw the roof. Yeah, and the roll bars. Whoa, so let's go like this. Whoop, whoop, two straight lines, and then for the roof, just like that. Whoa, and then back here, Whoa, and yep, more straight lines. And then, whoa, a circle right there, and that's the steering wheel. Whoa, and then let's actually draw the mouth. Yeah, it has a really cool design on the side. Yeah, like a T-Rex mouth. Whoa, a really wide triangle. And then we need a bunch of teeth. Let's use black again, ready? A bunch of small triangles. Now on the bottom. Wow! Now does that look like a fierce rig? Yeah! I know it does! It looks so fun! Well, speaking of fun, if you had fun drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. All right, see you again, bye-bye. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout, Flippy. Hey, it's me, Flippy. Are you ready to draw a crane with me? Yeah, this is gonna be so much fun. I love cranes because they're so tall. Yeah, on the construction site, they can lift very heavy things and move it to a different location. Whoa, I'm gonna take this dark orange and draw this part of the crane. It goes straight up and down. Whoa, that's really tall. Whoa, and straight up and down. And now some zigzags. Woo! <laughs> And now opposite side zigzags, just like that. Whoa, yeah, that gives it structural integrity. Nice and strong, there we go. All right, and we'll go like this. Yeah, and that's the base. It's not moving. Yeah, it stays in one spot, but it spins around and grabs things. Okay, let's go like this. Woo, woo, there we go. And now, yeah, now we can draw the boom. Whoa, the really long horizontal straight part. Just like that, okay? And now we can draw some really thin rectangles in there. Whoa, there we go, yeah! And that's the cabin, the cab. That's where the operator sits. Yeah, let's just draw a little window right there. Whoa, cool! And then check this out, whoa! Goes back like that, draw a rectangle. And actually, now let's take the color black. So then we can draw the cable that goes all the way down. Whoa! And then this part, yeah, grabs things. But let's go like this. Yeah, and then we can connect it to there, down to here, and watch this. Yeah, I'll take black and go like this. Whoop, yeah. And what these are? Whoa, those are weights, counterweights. It's so heavy right here. Sometimes they carry some big things. Things that are so big, yeah, like that? I don't even know what that is, but I know it's very heavy, and they need weights right here to counterweight it. There we go. That was so much fun drawing a crane with you. If you wanna draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. All right, see you again, bye-bye. Make learning fun So much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi So much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi Hey, it's 
me flippy. <laughs> I was just acting like a dinosaur. Yeah, maybe like a T-Rex. <sighs> or a Triceratops, or a Stegosaurus. Wow, dinosaurs are so cool. They used to live on our planet millions of years ago. And I have an idea, why don't we draw a dinosaur footprint? All right, here we go. Whoa, lots of curved lines, like this. Whoa, and dinosaur footprints, yeah, are a great way to tell to see how big the dinosaurs were, or maybe what they ate. Yeah, since I'm using a brown marker, it kind of looks like it got its footprint in mud, right? Yeah, now let's draw some triangles. Whoa, yeah, that's where the claws touch the ground. Wow, doesn't that look cool? Whoa, what a great way to learn about dinosaurs. Whoa, I sure do love drawing with you. And if you love drawing with me and want to draw some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. -P -P -I. All right, see you again. Blippi, come on everyone, let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi, so much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout. Blippi! <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. Do you see me? Yeah, do you see how I'm wearing glasses? Why don't we draw my glasses together? Yeah! All right, they're pretty hard to draw, but I think you got this. First, let's start with a long straight line. There we go, for the top. And then two bubbles, half circles. <laughs> there we go, perfect. And then you have to draw the arms. Yeah, that's what holds them on to your face, your ears. All right, there we go, a little hook. Perfect, and then one over here. Whoa, wow, don't those look good? Yeah, well, since they're my glasses, maybe we can color them in with orange. Woohoo! All right, there we go. Whoa, I love drawing and coloring, and I love my glasses. Whoa, well, this is the end of this video, and if you wanna keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I P P I Blippy. See you again. Bye bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make the